the free floating mower decks on these simplicity lawn tractors are really good at improving cut quality. Roller bar on the back of the deck actually rolls on the ground so it cuts to your terrain better than a standard deck that's just hanging from the garden tractor. The other thing it does is lays down the grass in the direction that you're mowing to create nice stripes. However, there may be times you want to mow without this roller bar engaging the ground. If you have rough areas of your lawn, this is going to really kind of violently shake this mower deck up and down and just wear everything out faster than normal. The other time you may want to mow without that roller bar engaging the ground is like I have here. It's a new seating. I top dressed with sand and that roller bar can kind of damage dirt, loose soil, especially when turning it kind of digs in and disturbs the ground a little bit. So I want to mow this new area um, to do minimal impact on my new grass and loose ground without that roller bar engaged. The good news is we can do that and I'm going to show you how. Now to do this, all we have to do is leave our deck in transport mode and lower our height of cut setting all the way down. You can see now the deck is hanging freely without that roller bar engaged. So now we can mow just like any other lawn tractor with the deck suspended from the lawn tractor. Now the one big negative to this obviously is you've got very little adjustability on the height of cut when you do this. So in its current setting, it's going to deliver about a three inch height of cut and we can make one adjustment to that. I'll show you how to do that. When the deck is suspended from the lawn tractor, it is doing that with these tension cables on the back. You can see there's a simple cotter pin holding this onto the deck. And these need to be removed when you, when you take the deck off of the lawn tractor. But you can see here, we've got another hole available. So let's move these. You can see the other one on the other side. There's two of these. Let's move these to this hole see what happens to our height of cut. To move those cables we need to take tension off them so we're going to have to raise our height of cut so our deck is now sitting on our back roller. Then we want to put it into free float mode and if we come down here we can see our cables are now loose. We can pull the pin, grab the washer, and pop it into the other hole. Now we just need to repeat on the other side. All right, we've got this side moved over and the opposite side, let's see what happened to our height of cut. So we're gonna follow the same procedure. We're gonna put this thing back in transport mode. We're gonna adjust our height of cut all the way down so our bar is off the ground. Now we'll see where we're at. Now we're up about three and a half inches. So we've got two options to cut without the bar engaged in the ground, three inches or three and a half inches. And really, if we're talking about a rough area or a new seating, we probably don't want to cut much lower than that. So. Hope that little tip helped you out. Thanks for watching. Adios.